All right, and welcome back to Guardians of the Galaxy. We are continuing on to build the bridge to find our teammates. All right, guys. So let's continue on. So these are some kind of memories here. Let's just talk to Ventus. Yes, Peter. Hey, I'm sorry we made you feel uncomfortable before. I didn't mean to cause you any pain. Thank you, Peter. I know I said some things I regretted as well. But everything's going to work out. I know it. So is this what your mind's like all the time? Not always. Sometimes I can create my own little world to live in. I come here whenever I feel overwhelmed. What? I've been able to hone my powers during the centuries I was imprisoned. It was my only refuge during those times of darkness. So, what do I do now? So, each memory, each emotion will help build a bridge. You should gather more memories until we can find a path across. Okay. Gotta keep feeling stuff. <laughs> Good luck. This is my chance, Peter. To protect my new family. That's curious. Your bond with Drax is very strong. But I don't understand. You... You can sense Drax, but Drax is dead. I can't explain it, but I can certainly feel his presence through your emotions. He's dead! What? Oh, he didn't die! Holy shit! Son of a bitch! Son of a, son of a bitch gets thrown into a big bad worm and survives. I can get her back, Pete, if we charge the forge. We can revive Lila. <laughs> Peter, I'm beginning to sense Gamora. You've told me how you feel about the Guardians. That's good. But in order to find your friends, I'll need more. What how do you mean? think your friends feel about being Guardians? Huh. Um. How do my friends feel about feel about happy? Pissed off, proud, annoyed, regret, conflicted. What should I pick? Hmm. I guess not pissed off or regret or annoyed. That leaves us with happy, proud, and conflicted. Conflicted, so, um, what does that even mean? I guess they're conflicted about whether they're happy to be the Guardians or not. Select the motion filter as the Guardians. I'm proud of the Guardians. The self -dead is body. We're gonna sell Thanos' body! Check out the self body! Look at the sound of Alice's body! <laughs> Idiot. Idiot! <laughs> Prudent. Yeah. Honestly, we all stay because of you, Peter.
What? No drags this time. This is my hour of honor. My sweet wife and daughter have finally been avenged. This is very unsettling. But please keep trying. You're doing great. I didn't think I was actually capable of feeling this many emotions. I'm so deep. Let's just try once more. You and the Guardians have had so many amazing adventures. How would you describe your... Happiest moment with them. Um, awesome, heroic, okay, proud. Awesome! I think that's enough. If you explore all these memories, we should have what we need to build our bridges. by adoring fans. I couldn't let them go thirsty. Mm -hmm. It seems you have many cheerful emotions towards Rocket. Yeah, I do. Cheerful emotions towards Rocket. I have cheerful emotions towards the rodent. Tracks the destroyer has purpose. Well, let's go to get some um, the rodent. That's the bridge. <laughs> Makes sense. Rocket's been here the whole time. In spite of everything you've been through, Rocket cares about you a great deal. He must really value your friendship to remain at your side. I'm glad he stuck around. He's a good friend. I suspect that is why he stayed. He knows how well you two get along, how much you need each other. So, I know what Rocket is, but what's with all these other light orb thingies? They represent your feelings, Peter. You should explore them. Let's get Gamora. I still can't believe we did it. Thanos is gone. No, we killed Thanos. Yes. You must be very close to Gamora. You've shown many positive emotions for her. What the hell? What's wrong with my keyboard? It works, but at the same time it doesn't work. What the fuck? I still can't believe I have emotions towards a robot. That's messed up. I know this place. I've been here. This is Thanos' training room from Gamora's memory. Gamora hated her father. Why would she go back? Maybe because it's the only home she's known. She never stuck around anywhere before she joined the Guardians. To be alone in the world... It's not easy. Okay, so I know where Gamora is, but there's still more of these emotion orb things. <laughs> yeah, you get dragged, so. Trax the Destroyer has purpose once again! Yes, Trax is back. If Drax is somehow still out there, your feelings can lead us to him. So he didn't die in vain. Yeah, that son of a bitch. The 
that goddamn son of a bitch. He never goes down. He created the bridge to Drax and, um, you know, the question mark. Thank you. <laughs> What does this mean, Mantis? It means Drax is alive! And it means you left him for dead. Poor Drax! He must be so lonely! No. Drax, oh god, I feel terrible. We all thought Drax was dead. We may have assumed too quickly. Oops. The others will be so excited that Oops. he's still alive. His sacrifice caused so much turmoil. Hopefully this will repair what was broken in your team. Okay, so back to the ship. On to the, um... Back to the ship with Rocket. Go to get Drax and then Gamora. Good. I'm proud of you, Peter. You did well connecting with your emotions. I hate my emotions. I know emotion. it couldn't have been easy. For someone such as yourself. What? Not everyone can connect with people as easily as I can. Surprising people is my specialty. <laughs> yes, and you are certainly full of surprises. So, I guess we just have to pick them up. Who should we get first? Let's go grab Drax. Let's go. Light up the engines and that kill rocket. We're gonna get our buddy Drax back. Drop, drop him. What about that giant creepy worm thing? If it's still alive, I'm getting the hell out of town. Don't worry. If Drax is alive, I got money on that thing being dead. He actually did it. Drax! Holy crap! You, you did, that worm was, that was, you came out of it. Like you were inside it and then you, you came out? That's amazing. You doubted me, Peter Quill? What's wrong, man? You look pretty down for a guy who just defied death. I was merely reflecting on the circumstances. The creature did not give up easily. Our battle raged for hours. I felt... proud. But I think I was happier butchering that hideous worm than when I got revenge on my daughter's killer. How could that be? I cannot find a reason for it. That worm has no importance to me. How can this battle mean more to me than ours against Thanos? Okay, I'm sorry. Are we talking about the same worm? Here, I mean, look at it. That is a big worm. It's way bigger than Thanos. I mean, of course you felt good killing it. Indeed, it was the largest foe I have ever vanquished. <laughs> but I do not see how size correlates to satisfaction. In the midst of battle, I felt such exhilaration, and nothing else. I spared not a single thought for Kamaria. I think I am afraid that with each passing moment, her memory will continue to disappear. I fear that once I forget, Kamaria will die a second death. These feelings will not stop. I don't think that's true at all. Your memories of your family will last forever. Kamaria will always be a part of you. That is impossible. She is not a part of me. She is dead! Oh, I am not used to being afraid of anything. Oh, 
If only I were dead. These feelings would not cause me such distress. No matter how hard I try! For someone who says he wants to die, you suck at it. Like, I don't know what to tell you, Drax. Maybe, uh, maybe you're just invincible. Of course. I must be invincible. <laughs> but this only makes things worse. I was not completely honest with you before. I did wish to protect the Guardians. But part of me hoped that I might see my daughter again in the afterlife. If such a thing does exist, I do not know. But the thought of reuniting with my family... I know we aren't blood tracks. And I know we can't replace Kamaria. But the Guardians are your family now. And we need you. Here. Uh, perhaps you are right. Of course. If I die now, I would leave you with the same loss I feel for Kamaria. Point Death take. can wait. Yes, it Thank can. Thank you, my friend. Good job. I feel more sure of my path forward. Good. Finally. God damn it. Hey, guys, it's all clear. Bring the ship down. Now, let us return to your garbage heap of a ship. Excuse the me! The galaxy is counting on us to stop Hala. And I have wasted enough time beside this rotting carcass. Hey, it might be a garbage heap, but it's our garbage heap. <laughs> Most of that garbage is yours, Peter. <laughs> what a buffoon. Oh well, we like it, Drex. I wonder how it's gonna, how rocket's gonna flip. Oh, sanctuary, training installation. All right. Huh? You expecting any calls today? Starlord. <laughs> I do not know how you escaped the shrine, but there is nowhere you can run to now. You and your guardians will suffer greatly for what you have done. Oh, I'm not running from you at all. In fact, I think you are running from me. Enjoy making snipe jokes while you can. It will be short-lived. You have stolen everything from me. Oh, go ahead. I will kill everyone you've ever known, everyone you've ever loved. This is between you and me, Hala. Think about what you're doing. Oh, I am. What? She hung up on me. I can't believe she hung up on me. <laughs> you're unbelievable, Quill. <laughs> I am Groot. Yeah, you said it. Hala always looked that... gnarly? It's as I said. The Forge is taking its toll on her. Yeesh. If she's coming from nowhere, we've got to hustle. Keep the engine running. I'll be back soon. Okay, time to get Gamora. So, where is she? Don't you think Gam's gonna be a little pissed at you? What are you gonna say? <laughs> I'm sure I'll think of something in the moment. <laughs> Word of advice, Pete. Think harder. Gamora? You've got some nerve. Following me here, of all places. I told you I was done. I'm not in a very charitable mood, Peter. Leave. Or I'll make you leave. Or are you here to fight? I'm sorry. Are, <laughs> are you threatening me? Not a threat. A promise. Well, then bring it! Whoa. You said you'd keep everyone together! Hala is more powerful than ever. Now Drax is dead! Drax isn't dead. What? 
<sighs> Why didn't you open with that? Drax is alive? And you didn't bother mentioning it before? I was working up to it. Work up to it faster next time. <laughs> he was devoured by that thing. You said he was gone. I thought he was, but he's not. He killed that space worm and is now hanging on the Milano with everyone else. Drax is back to his, well, his, uh, his normal self. Ah! What? Ah, I just don't get it. Why does everything just work out for you? I know, right? No matter what you do, everything just conveniently works out for the great Star-Lord. You call this working out? The Guardians are scattered, Drax nearly got eaten, you almost killed me two seconds ago. Oh, and Hall is out to destroy the galaxy because of me. But despite that, we're all unscathed. So Drax happened to survive. But you told him to sacrifice himself, knowing full well that it could kill him. Can't you even pretend to be bothered by that? Show me something, anything, at least some semblance of remorse. Just because I like to crack jokes doesn't mean I don't feel bad, Gamora. It's called deflecting. Maybe that's how you deal with things. But I'm not like that. Well then, get used to me. You shrug through everything, free of consequence, while I... I feel punished for merely existing. I've done so many horrible things. Really? Like what? I fought. I tortured a little girl. All because I was too scared to stand up to Thanos. And now, my sister is dead. I'll never be able to forgive myself. You made a mistake coming back, Peter. You were as much of a victim as Nebula was. But Thanos is to blame, not you. Thanos may have given the order, but the blade was in my hand. Rocket pushes people away to hide his pain. Drax revels in his rage. But I don't know how to get past it. All the lives I've ruined. I've hurt so many people. Despicable acts I did to serve Thanos. You haven't hurt me, Gamora. Ever. Everyone that gets close to me winds up hurt. If I go back with you, I'll just make it worse. I don't even know why you bothered coming here. Rock. You're also the only one who gets my jokes. <sighs> I can't do this without you. I close my eyes at night, and I'm right back here. I'm that frightened girl, unsure of what or who to trust. I want nothing more than that pain to be over. You have to forgive yourself, Gamora. It's the only way you can move forward. Right. You're right. <laughs> oh, come on, not another sappy moment. <laughs> well, I guess we got I guess we got the team together. Finally. Hey, Drax. Surprised to admit it, I'm actually glad to see you. I too am glad you have not perished in a violent and agonizing way. Perhaps by sudden evisceration or Bailanese organ chewing. <laughs> I once saw a man have his organs chewed. <laughs> How we laughed at his pain. Yep. Definitely the same old Drax. Absence does make the heart grow fonder, unfortunately. We're all here. Now what? Welcome home, everyone. I am Groot. Groot says it's so good to see you all. 
Look at you, Peter. Somehow you managed to get us all back in the same room. I didn't think we'd see each other after last time. Unless, you know, we ended up in the same prison. Again. Hey, good times. Hmm. We kind of made a mess out there. Now we gotta clean it up. We? Okay, some of us made it more than others. I wish I had better news for you, but, uh, things have turned into a bad monster movie out there. Yes, Hala and the Eternity Forge have merged into a singular being. But where the relic granted life, Hala absorbs life. We accidentally created a supervillain. Go team. Yes, we created a worthy adversary. I am impressed with us. <laughs> she has to be stopped before she strikes again. Hala contacted me. She said this won't end until we're dead or she is. There's only one thing we can do. I'll get the cyanide pills. I am grooved. Fine, fine, I'll just get mine. <laughs> the Roden is right. Our chances of victory have not improved since the last time we fought her. Hala is heading for nowhere. For us. I'm open to suggestions on how we approach this. Hello. All right, guys, and thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I really appreciate all the support you've given us. Uh, please comment, like, and subscribe for more awesome content. And please also check out all of these thumbnails around me for more fantastic content from projects. All right? All right, and until the next time, bye-bye.